Southeast Asian Delta. The weird ward spots. Because, you know, occasionally we see one here, that's really common there, common. Up on the cliffs up here, common. But Southeast Asian. Oh, Storm Spray jump again, the concussive shot. It's not quite long enough, but he's got more than enough mana to finish off the sniper. And what's that? 3 and 0, 6 minutes in. He's well on his way to dominating this uh, poor little Keen at mid. But and there's, there's, there's hardly like an opportunity for someone to TP in, although they're trying to make a kill on the tight answer again in the bot lane. Can they? Oh, well, I guess with yeah. Pulse Nova, there's no real problem there. Then Edith comes off cooldown for the tier 1 tower. So this core left rank, he's getting kills on the Tidehunter, but whether or not he can survive up against Chrissy on the Storm Spirit, who jumps back onto the Sand King. Bow Strike, actually going aggressive here. Chrissy, do you have enough mana to zip forward? One more hit! Just enough to bring down the SK, but the, the Storm's dead. Assassinate from Nana is ready, and you've already... Oh, he disjoins it with a zip. That's not enough damage now. Wow. That's going to be a sad sniper. Wow. That was Sniper's gone back towards mid. Nana... You're zero and four, you've got no items whatsoever. He's dead again. He's actually dead again. That aggressive ward. Chrissy, yep, six and zero. Nine minutes into the game, and he's got a DD rune. They try to turn things around, the glimpse back, Sky they're gonna get a counter kill at the very least. They get something out of this. And it goes to the left track, no. who's like the only Chrissy? real hope right now. Chrissy, do you have enough money? You've got stick charges. Try and zip forward, no vision. One more hit to- Oh, he gets it! Oh my god, these wards are ridiculous! These aggressive wards from Rave are, are so spot on, it's it's insane! Jero trying to turn things back around onto Extinct, the Burrow Strike, they get a kill on a core. Something they've been waiting to do for the past 10 minutes or so. Basically outside Rave's base, as they're trying to take tier 3s. But FCFC getting caught here, the big dive from Rave coming in. Dire Ravage from the Tidehunter, catches the Lash and Disruptor, luckily enough for them. Static Storm is thrown out, but... Connecting field just a little bit too late. Missing Flare. Plenty of damage onto the axe, but Sand King with a blink epicenter. Does quite a lot of damage. Still three heroes down for invasion, as Enigma's the only one to fall. Sand King with a sneaky play, he's catching the troll. But he'll lose his life for this one. I don't know if you actually saw the Sand King actually whiffed his ulti a bit there. I think the fight would have been very different if he didn't. He He's, he channeled his ulti and then blinked into some- Assassinate, nope, assassinate, out of range, or cancelled. FCFC still slowed down and nuked by the Mystic Flare from Sky. Now the Blink Ravage, Rio has the Blink, catches four of them! As two are wiped out immediately, Lash Dragon sinking down for the count, Storm gets nuked by the sun, uh, by the Sniper. Don't know why I wanted to call him Sansa there, but that's, that's a great team fight from Rave. The Tidehunter making that Blink debut an absolutely massive turn around there as it looked like Invasion wants to take a tier 1, they just got completely wrecked. And now they go for more! Anchor, sla uh, anchor Smash from the Tide taking down Extinct on the Disruptor. FZFZ, is this just gonna be a complete team wipe? Threshold not achieved, Chrissy dropping low, oh! Did he switch treads or something there? Axe getting a double kill with two Culling Blades. Storm Spirit just lost like 100 HP or 7 in a lot of situations. Oh, the Blink Power Strike catches that J.O., he's got no Aegis, he's got no BKB. Ghost now with the axe, just catch him in the Berserk's Call, the first uh, first Enigma black hole of the game. And Glimpse was used on J.O. in fact, not on the Enigma. But look at the damage from that Pulse Nova. How many is he going to take down? Three? Four? Even Chrissy walks in and wishes he had an FZFZ with a triple kill. First point of contact, Ghost. Pretty sure they've seen them. J.O. is in the Roche Pit, along with the Sky they go straight on the Enigma. Before he gets his BKB off, Sandstop is the Axe, Blade Mail returns damage from that Scarf Mage ulti, Black Hole though. Ninja Boogie turns it back around, FZFZ the last track, magic damage does nothing against the double BKB from Rave. And all of a sudden, the Dire come out on top. They go for the Enigma with Spirit, with Wave of Terror or anything like that. Le level 1 Roche now is... So, so again. <laughs> Also because the bounty runes, there are always so many heroes there. Now J.O. walks in, Rio gets start and stop, so he can't actually ravage. Will fall and J.O. with- it. Doesn't have Aegis. Who has Aegis Immortal? The Storm Spirit, who's now joining the team fight. Chrissy hasted up, but there's no targets left. Do they actually continue here? Tidehunter with that ravage would have been an amazing opener to this team fight. ADTR, one more click. Storm, you've got to go for this. Orchid finishes him off as Chrissy now tries to go for more and FCFC is going to be the second target just manages to get that deny from the Bloodstone before Chrissy. Portal expiring on the Storm Spirits, they don't really want to go in there and 
you know, risk losing it, but it looks like the Black Hole and the, the Axe and the Sand King gonna make this fight well worth it for Rave, as they were technically 4 and 5, tied out the Blinks in BKB, baited and forced there from Rio. It's the exact same thing that happened bottom, actually. As soon as Invasion see the Storm Spirit's gone, they overstep a bit, thinking... Because, I guess, they, the thing that is at the front of their mind is the Storm Spirit. They're really, yeah. really worried about him. They see him disappear, they're like, ah, oh, okay, relax. Oh, Sniper, you've had enough of this during the laning phase. Blink Ravage catches three, no more BKB left, and this is going to be a full team wipe. Pretty much game over here for Invasion's Rave. Uh, storming away from this, but yeah, Exactly like you said, they're scared of the Storm Spirits, so once he leaves, they think, okay, we'll go and fight. But it, it's pretty much exactly what I was saying. Less Strike is standing on this ramp, and your two initiators are on this ramp. They're, kind of like they're what, two, two they're three thousand teammates. range away, and you've got no way of actually closing the gap and getting into the team fight. Yeah, and Troll's got a dagger, Tide's got a dagger, Enigma's got a dagger, Skyrat even has a four star. They're gonna catch you, and yeah, that's what happens, so yeah. the series gets split. They're going to catch you, and you are going to die. Okay, so that's uh, the entire...